this video, we're going to look at HTML or hypertext markup language. And this is a language that websites are written in across the world wide web. On the left hand side, as you can see, this is the HTML code. And on the right hand side of our HTML editor, you can see the way your web page will be displayed. If we look a little closer at the HTML code, we will see that it's made of what we call elements. Now, elements have three parts. They have a tag. In this case, we have a header tag or H1 tag, and it have a closing tag that tells that element where it ends. And closing tags have a forward slash. And within the tags, you get the content. And this is what will be displayed on your web page. There are other elements, for instance, we have the opening HTML tag and the closing HTML tag. This tells the computer that it's going to be a web page written in HTML. We have another part here called the body, where we have an opening body tag and a closing body tag. And any HTML code within here will be displayed on your web page. Another element we have here is the paragraph element, which has an opening tag, which is a P within brackets, and a closing tag, which is the letter P again. And again, anything within this area will be displayed on the web page. And now you can see the content of your web page on the right hand side of the editor. You can see that it will display the heading. This is a heading and the paragraph, this is a paragraph. And if we were to change this text within our header tags, when we click the run, it will change on the right hand side. So if I type in here, this is a new heading and click run, you can see that it is automatically changed on the web page viewing section here. And if I was to add a new paragraph, I would open a bracket, P, close the bracket, and type in the content I want to display. And then you must remember to close your tag with a bracket, forward slash, in this case, it's a paragraph tag. And again, close your bracket. And then to, this, to see the change in your web page, you click on 